Hi there, after 28 here, yet again with R6. This video will not contain a speedrun, but... I'm gonna try to replicate get a glitch I accidentally discovered when I was doing IL runs. Or not IL runs, I was just... I was actually intentionally looking that is there something I could do faster in mission 12 and... Well, let's just say I finished managed to find a, a way to save um, six, maybe even seven seconds when executed really well. So we would have a mission time of 40, 43 seconds in mission 12. Exact same setup than what I use in full game runs. So and what my current goal split is also constructed from. So assuming we do many well. Um, that's not how it's supposed to go, but, well, okay, so, it almost kind of worked immediately. If I just go right away and keep myself facing in the correct direction, I should be fine. I just need to find an optimized run. That's not good. It is. Oh, yeah, I can, yeah, you can clip through that mission is totally broken, to say the least. Hold up. Don't run here, that's a very dangerous idea. I'll just get out. Almost failed it, and here we go. <laughs> oh god, second try. That was too slow. Wait. Uh, well, you see what I meant with that glitch. But I've executed 43 seconds already, so... Uh, let's give it a few more tries. I think it's all up to that, that where are you facing? No. Okay. Um, it's hard when you, when you, when you just, when you just execute it, but you really don't know theory behind that. That's difficult. But we now know that it's kind of possible. It's something like, no. I should manage to, like you said, I should clip through him. That's the issue. That's the only way I've got it to work. So you have to give a really small leeway, or that that's just the, how I've managed to make it work. So don't be totally optimized here. Go here. Um. Well, <laughs> I kind of pulled it off. I kind of pulled it off. Ideally, you wouldn't even crouch there and you just run through doors and... Yeah. You... I don't know, can you do non-stop? Like, I don't know how... How much the guy after... Upstairs... Camera room is... How easily he's gonna aggravate. That's my issue. But I think that... Maybe 42 seconds in-game time is possible. I'm really just trying to get an idea on mission 12. Because seriously, this mission is the riskiest one in the run. Yeah, that run made it fail. You can't jump. No, not run. Jump. Yeah, I really lost my English. But fuck that. I just executed. I've gotten 43 off recording. Now I would like to record a 43. I already got 45. Which isn't bad either, considering that my gold splits have 49 second execution time. That was a bit too bad. Oh well. I might be early, yeah. 
That was too early. Detection mechanisms are pretty weird, to say the least. And I knew that when I came back to this mission one day and just tried to exploit it and I found this accidentally. I'm late. Maybe not. I was late. Well, you can't always win. These guys are fun to shoot, no matter what. Um... Actually... I want to try something out. Like... This might be an impossible... Time, but I wanna know, what's the... What's the perfect? What is it? So... We'll actually do a small change to set up it. I'll go look for cheat codes. And then we'll go back for the glitch. Yeah, Beckenbar has bad combination of demolition and... And then... Electronics. Which will be helpful when lockpicking. I know Beckenbar is way too loud though when when running or even walking to that area or that I've encountered it, so this would be impossible, but who knows if someone finds the way we could I'm just gonna get cheats so I'm gonna remove terrorist quickly and I'm not gonna use any other cheats, I'm just gonna remove turret, although I know there is a cheat code for unlocking all doors. But that's not really what I wanna do. Full health, hostage can be killed. No, no, no. Where the fuck is. No terrors, there we go. So. Alright, then now the mission is failed because we apparently killed it all. And let's... Let's see, what's... Can we go for sub-40 when executing this way? I also try to go for not triggering, uh, triggering any alarms. Since this could be a theoretical best possible theoretical So we'll see If I just could No I'm clipping through it stairs whatever whatever Oh god Oh, no. That all up doesn't matter. This one does. Now, I go here. I know this room is also way too dangerous for running and... I get out and... Okay, so there could be even a second in in-game timer. How much was the... 37, okay. So, yeah, if there was some more exploits to be found, then we could save like 12 seconds from world record in this mission. Now, I'll enable terrorist back. It's easier to do it here. So, here we go. I'll quickly check, have they already spawned in? If they have... I think fast that ways. Okay, they don't spawn. Yeah, 
I think I should have been found yet already. And whatever. I'll I'll give you a try for Beckenbar to see if you can do it with him. So the estimate would be between 35 and 37. Short stoppage there. Go, go, go. Is that game bar too loud? Maybe he is, but... He's not! He's not! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> how, was, how fast was it though? 46, god damn it! <sighs> yeah, I played it safe, you have to go very risky. I don't know, it's maybe in there that... They can't hear me if alarm is still... Ringing. I'll go. Like, that 43 was with Chavez, and I ran a lot. And movement was pretty optimized, too. Also, as a side note, I've never executed single man tactics with Beckenbauer. Which really surprised me as possible. Considering that, that's late. But considering the fact that his stealth is like really low well in this game, it's not that bad in PC version where it's like, if I recall, it was maybe 72 out of 100. But in this one, it looks like it's like 40 out of 100. And Chavez is just a safe strike. Although you could use Hanley, but it it takes a tad more time in menu to get them. I know it could make your lockpick operating faster. And also... And I don't know, I could save some time in menu if I chose not to use light armor, but... I'm really skeptical of it, yeah. So far I failed all my attempts with it, but... Yeah, if there's a f if there's found a setup where you can use medium armor... ...without aggravating... ...the guy in hallway before... ...computer, you... ...you'd save some time in menu. Which is always a plus. Other than that, there's not much to do in this mission. You just gotta execute everything really well. Also, yeah, it's, m it's much more inconsistent than my three and a half second wait time. Oh, I think I'm actually getting, getting it. Like, if that one guy isn't running after me and just stays in in the doorway or outside outside the open open hall area before entering stairs I think that might be a reason why I'm sometimes getting mission failed after I run through him and don't get instant mission failed. I don't know. It's a fucking complicated glitch. Or trick or exploit, however you want to call it. I, I don't even know how to define. I'll give you a few shots for 43. And if I can't pull it off, well, I just done. I still post this video to YouTube. That was perfect. That was not. 
which requires a really good entry to get 43, right? Like, a really small mistake is allowed to get 43. If you just run as long as you can. I really hope someone would, else would speedrun this game actively as I do. Man, what are you gonna do? God damn it! <laughs> but that clipping pisses me off. Also, I may should use I should use a little bit my brain power to find find fucking out how the how much I should wait. Yeah. How much I should wait to get it right. To get that get that timing really good. So I just be capable of performing it with super good consistency. Like I did with the slower version of this exploit. This mission failed already. Alright. I felt like I could not avoid triggering alarm. You really gotta turn in fast to buy yourself as much time as possible. That's really what I want. That was too long waiting time. Oh, it was not, but. Okay, and that kind of inconsistency just makes me think that I really don't really feel behind a glitch. But yeah, this is a super broken mission. It just is. I know you could also... Completed without triggering any alarm, if I remember right. I saw one guy doing it. Also, if you play on harder difficulty levels, uh, you should note that cameras are moving much faster on hard difficulty. I learned that hard hard way on live stream <laughs> when I tried to execute these speed stress Since well, these are possible to execute even on hard. These are possible on hard. <sighs> All the way to that part, when you go upstairs and go into camera room, that, yeah. Well, maybe with perfect waiting time before entering room, yeah, then it is possible. But other than that, yeah. Stick with something easier, like the library. Library exploit I'm using. Or I used to use right before. I can't recall when I started to use this trigger alarm. Wait three and a half seconds. Run. Run around the first guard and then run around the second guard. I really can't recall when I started to use. Okay, but yeah, my patience is running out on this one. I know I haven't been recording for a long time. Yeah, <laughs> 19 minutes to showcase an in inconsistent glitch. Sure, what the fuck no. Okay. One more suc successful mission complete. No matter the time. There are possibilities for risk of running, risk of running and cr crouching later. I'm just so unfamiliar with. So unfamiliar with that that part.
Okay. Whatever. Ah, oh, crap. I would have liked to salvage that. But Verl is not on my side. So yeah. You know how it goes then. Dude, that's too slow. Whatever. I'm gonna die when I'm jumping down. Oh! Well, what do you know? Well, this is my last attempt. That's for sure. Yeah, this is one thing you don't want to end encounter in speedrun. If you're a new runner, don't get too upset. You may even proceed to fu finish your run. Uh oh. I think I fucked up. Yeah, I sure did. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. We'll finish this here. All I need to prove was that, that it worked. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.